one of the things that you can see about Idris is his reading of the game is extremely good. Like Richie said in an interview that we did with him a couple of weeks ago, um, Idris isn't the tallest player, but he's got longer legs. So when you think you might be able to stretch past him, he just sticks a leg out and nicks the ball back or he gets a tackle in because he can make up an extra yard. Not that he's like Linford Christie in terms of sprinting or anything, but he can just he just manages to just to time his tackles and his interceptions and where he is on the pitch really well. So there's a lot of skillful attributes that he has. He can take the ball forwards as well. We've played him in a role that suits him, suits his key attributes, suits his skill set, his mindset, his attitude and his aptitude also to learn and pick up things as well because he came into a team that was was not completely new. You know, Kenny Jacket, bless him, last year, did sign some really technically gifted players. So there was only real sort of minor changes to the team this year. You know, we added George Moncur. We got Theo Archibald back but on a permanent deal from, from Lincoln. He was on loan uh, the previous year. Um, and then and Idris, like you say, was you know, the missing piece of the jigsaw puzzle that slotted in really well. His character seems really good. You know, to be named Players Player of the Year, you know, is something because there are a lot of characters. It's a really good dressing room this year. You can tell that um, we had our end of season awards. It's called the Starman Awards. Um, and he picked up two awards. You know, we asked Richie why why Idris when so many could be. And it's just he, he listed off his attributes in our in our in our uh, interview with him and it's just you know and, and it really explained you know he's a good trainer he's a good character that's when we fell in love with we managed to sign up steel archibald from lincoln last last summer kenny jacket had signed him on loan for a season um and uh, he, it turned out really well for him. They said never fall in love. And then a week or two later, after the season ended, it was announced that he, he'd signed. We were all delighted and delirious about it. He got himself injured earlier this season, so he's not really played much of the second half of the season, unfortunately. But from what he can produce and what, what we know he can produce, and the same for Idris, what he can do and what we know he can do, we're all aligned. And there's no reason why, as a League One player, he couldn't help us to establish ourselves in League One and help us ultimately to push on.